I'm actually nervous. Oh my god, so many things. What do I eat now? I'm so happy. I'm so happy right now. Kill it, just kill it! Today we are trying each other's favorite Poke Bowl orders. What do I not like about Poke Bowls is the question. Nothing. Your go-to fast food, but it's like healthy. You can customize them to be whatever you want. You can choose what you're feeling that day. But also I'm kind of scared of them because I get them very rarely. So I'm like, oh, I just want it to be good, but I never try anything new. Hi, I'm Karina. I'm new here at BuzzFeed Australia. This is my first video, but I'm really keen try new flavors today um, and potentially get some new faves as well. Hopefully, you know, you'll, you'll like me. <laughs> oh, please. So in this video, we're gonna try each other's Poke Bowl orders and rate them out of 10. Whoever gets the highest score is crowned the winner. My order is God tier. It is salmon sashimi, a base of brown rice and cabbage, delicious. And then we've got avocado, pickled ginger, wasabi mayo, chili flakes, and hold the seaweed salad. I know that might be controversial, people love it, but I am not into it. It looks like a salad. I have no idea what's going on in here. I can see kale, onion, we've got radish, we've got rice. What kind of rice is this? Brown rice? Is this cheese? You know, like shredded cheese. <laughs> Maybe it's bean sprouts. Look at that, love me some ginger. It does look like it has some spice in there. Let me just, uh... Mm, yeah, I can smell the spice. You know what the best part about this video is we get to eat all the leftovers. Mm-hmm, tastes exactly what you see. <laughs> Getting hit with the spice, but not too much spice. Like it's totally manageable. You get like the sauce dressing thingamabob in your mouth and it's very wasabi-y like. Wasabi is not horrible, but I'm just a little bit afraid of it because it's kind of, it tingles a bit, you know? I actually had a really traumatic experience with wasabi. I thought it was uh, guacamole and I put a whole tablespoon in my mouth. <laughs> Oh, no. When I was in Vegas once, and I've never like been able to stomach it since then. For someone who loves spice, this is like not spicy at all for me. There's so much flavor with all the spice. I really like when it's chaos in your food and you're like, oh my God, so many things. What do I eat now? It is a good one, but I think it's a five for me just because it just tastes like a normal salad. A seven out of 10. Solid, solid order. An eight out of 10. So my order, I usually like to get some spicy salmon with soba noodles and have it with sesame dressing. More wasabi! Are they wasabi peas? Are they good? Yeah, I think so. I'm scared. I'm actually nervous. This has so much interesting stuff going on. It has cooked fish, which is not what I usually get. There's a jalapeno here. Soba noodles, yes! This is good, a little bit of radish. <sighs> It smells delicious. I'm just gonna go all in. I'm not gonna be pretty with this. I don't really care because it's Poke Bowl. Let's go. Mmm, that salmon is so good. It's like umami and it's sweet and it's creamy. Oh God, that's really good. Mmm, mmm. Then we've got the wasabi peas, which are adding like a nice crunch, a nice little bit of spice. There is a level of spice this has that I was not expecting. Oh, seven noodles. I didn't get to the bottom of this bad boy. I think I'm missing a little bit of that acidic zing, which I like. I like chuck some ginger in here. I really disenjoy, is that a word? The fact that there's kale or whatever, like, it is too chewy for a leaf, you know? I want a leaf that just goes down very quickly. I'm so happy. I'm so happy right now. I'm pretty sure I'm about to eat a jalapeno and a wasabi pea in one go. What the hell am I thinking? Am I just getting better at my spice or what? I would not have been able to handle that like a year ago. The noodles is a great fucking addition. Would you pay two extra dollars for the noodles? I might. I might. It's, it's good. That's a nine out of 10 for me. Cause I don't really have much to fault it. Probably like a 9.5, really. Nine. It's good, it's really fucking good. So my order is the warm miso salmon bowl. A delicious succulent fillet of salmon. It's on a bed of soba noodles. It's got lots of different veggies in there. I add avocado to mine because we live in Australia and that's what Aussies do. And then I actually change the sauce for roasted sesame. Roasted sesame is god tier and I freaking love it. Oh my gosh, this looks so pretty. This looks a lot more exciting for me. <laughs> Another salmon order, I think. Top notch, can't go wrong. Some carrots in here and some nuts. It looks delicious. It smells incredible. Oh my God, I love these noodles. I'm a big fan already. Just on the salmon alone, this is better than the first one. <laughs> Where's the flavor? There is no flavor. There's no zing in this one. Like I can't see jalapenos or wasabi peas or anything like that. There's no chili flakes that I can see. And it's very mush. Maybe it's cause I put too much in my mouth. 
but the, it's all like mushy things. Because it's a poke bowl, it's delicious straight off the bat, but it's very mild. I like it has a crunch of the nuts. The salmon is quite flavorful. It's not like blowing me away. I say as I shuffle more into my mouth. I feel like I could really like smash this. This is good, but not that great. It's very creamy, which is great but there's not a lot else hitting there. I want some crunch and there's no crunch. I think it's a 6.5. A uh, solid like 7.5. This one gets an eight. So my usual order is Mr. X from Fishbowl and I add a little bit of guac. Actually, they don't have guac. Scratch all of that. They have just avocado, but I call it guac. So let me be. Salmon, cabbage, carrot, roasted sesame dressing, crispy shallots and wasabi peas. And usually I get it with a basic like sushi rice base. This one's full of color. Look at the color. That's a whole avocado. <laughs> Clearly everybody fucking loves salmon because we have some more salmon again. We've got some really claggy rice though, I will point out. It's quite bland, to be honest. I'm getting like safe option again. But like, the rice is still just very plain. The sashimi is just a little bit like lost in the ingredients of what else is going on. I think something with a bit more of like a zing would be really good. I'm really, I'm quite disappointed in that one. Like, I don't know. I said there's no bo bad poke and I don't believe that there is. But that's pretty forgettable. It's not that dissimilar to my order, so I may end up eating my words. It's just okay. Like, is this your one? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I think it's fine. It's just also not really presenting anything like super new to me. The dressing, I can't even really smell or taste a dressing there. No, I feel like... No, kill it more. Kill it, just kill it! Yeah. Um, no, like, I don't hate it. I definitely would eat it. <laughs> I would rate this a 6.5 out of 10. If I gave the other one a 6.5, I honestly think this one's like a 5 out of 10. I'm gonna rate this one like a 6 out of 10. And the winner is you! <laughs> really? Oh my god. Who wouldn't love my order? Good job, Corinna! Beautiful work, love. Spicy girls win.